I've enjoyed that. I'm going to go home and preach to myself the epilogue. Second Timothy 4. Um, uh, um, pardon me. Second Timothy 2.5. We have two little scriptures in there. And we close. Second Timothy 2.5. Gracias. Second Timothy 2.5. If anyone competes in a game, what is this game? Is this a game? You bet it is. It's the game of eternal life. He is not crowned unless he competes according to the Torah. Hey, yes. Amen. Hey, hey. There it is. Hey. Let's read it again. If you're going to compete in this thing called the Israelite experience, you must compete according to the rules. What's another way to say rules? Instructions. Torah. You can expect to get there because you're competing lawfully. You're not circumventing this thing. You're not hiding in a mega church. You're dealing with the issues that Yahweh is bringing to the line. You can expect the promise of Keter Chaim. Expect it. It's yours. Expect it. Because you're not running from your trials. You're working with Yahweh and counting the Omer together so you can come together on Mount Sinai on the Shavuot. And your fondness grows for each other as he's working on you, you're working on him, and he seems so distant. But don't worry, he's coming down to get close. I should have run. The trials will mostly be over, and he's coming to get close. But you got to compete lawfully, according to Torah. 2 Timothy 4, 8. Baruch Hashem. And here it is, we close with this. 2 Timothy 4, 8. For the rest, there is laid out for me the keter of tzedakah, the keter of the king, righteous crown, which the master, notice, not Rabbi Moshe, not Reina, not Zephania, not Rivka. It's always the master bringing the crown at his coming. It's always the master bringing the crown at his coming. If we climb now, he brings the crown. If we don't climb now, well, I don't know. That's between you and him. Good luck. You're going to need it. Climb now. Make me less emotional now. Make me more rooted and grounded in truth, not opinions now. Give me more bravery now. Give me more honor now. Get rid of my low self-esteem and give me a proper self-attitude. Baruch Hashem El. For the rest, the, there is laid up for me the crown of tzedakah, the keter, which the master, the shofet tzedakah, will give me on that day. When? Then. When? Then. On that day. Not to me only, Israel, but all those who love his appearing enough to count the omen. <laughs> this is not just a Rabbi Moshe teaching. He will give the keter to all those who love enough to do it his way and strive according to the rules. Father, we thank you. For your tov toward us. Chasing Keter. <laughs> Hallelujah! 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 Chasing Keter! Oh, Baruch Hashem. That looks more. You might care. To that of my hand. I might care. That's okay. Share. Hallelujah! Baruch Hashem. You want one? Father, we thank you, we thank you, we th oh, I'm so bummed. Keter, thank you, Abia. Father, Father, Father. <laughs> thank you for this Yom Shlish, Shloshim Vitesha. Baumer. Father, I pray that your people were challenged to give up these areas in, in their lives, to use the remaining week and three days or so to work on some of these areas of weakness and to set apart that day and to dedicate that day as a day of, of building Chochmah or Bina or, or Tiferet or Chesed. And Father, your people will take this message seriously and to heart. Father, we thank you for what you desire to do as you send this teaching around the globe through video and audio. Father, let it be reproduced and let it be passed on to all the children of the exile who have yet to return. And those who are, are, are returning, that it would help them in their return. 
as they climb up. They've been redeemed by the Pesach lamb, but they're climbing up to get to the 50th gate where they get to see Yahweh. And that's Keter, when we get to see you, and you get to see us in person, and you give us that Keter. Because we read in scripture, first Kepha, and in second Timothy, there is the master who brings the Keter. We chase the Keter, but you bring the Keter. Father, thank you. In Yahshua's name. Shalom. I wanted to invite you into the studio to share what I believe is probably the most powerful tool that Yahweh has given us in bringing the revelation and the understanding and the knowledge of the two houses together. And it's called the Restoration True Name Scriptures. Restoration Scriptures True Name Edition. The Restoration Scriptures True Name Edition is available from Your Arms to Israel International Ministries Publishing. Quite simply, there is no Bible on the market today like it. There are over 5,000 special footnotes regarding the coming together of the two houses. Every scripture in both covenants, the Tanakh and the Brich HaDashah, is covered and highlighted with a running commentary throughout. Allow me to read a few things to you regarding the Restoration Scriptures True Name Edition that's now available from us at Your Arms to Israel Publishing. For a self-published Bible, this is, we must say, honestly, before Yahweh, one of the most important works ever brought forth in these latter days. Every copy is bonded leather, genuine leather. Every copy will have a bookmark and many, many other things. This Bible will last you for a lifetime. The Restoration Scriptures True Name Edition will highlight, as I mentioned, a running commentary on all two house references. The Restoration Scriptures will also preserve the true names of cities, places, people, and events in the actual Hebrew names and Hebraic terms, all the while preserving a familiar English format. The Restoration Scriptures will also feature a unique paraphrasing capturing the mind of Yahweh. We're not going to focus in primarily on the Greek or the Aramaic. Rather, we are going to take all sources, we have taken all sources, and we've compiled them together to do a unique paraphrase thought for thought translation. The Restoration of Scriptures is going to capture the very heart and mind of Yahweh to form a single, one new man bride from Adam until the end of the age. The True Name Restoration of Scriptures will highlight the fact that Yahweh always had one elect, one kihila, and one bride. And so when the Aramaic captures the mind, we paraphrase that into the English. When the Greek captures the mind and heart of Yahweh, as we perceive it, we put that from the Greek. We're not limited or stuck to any language or to any particular translation. The Restoration of Scripture's True Name Edition has inserted what we believe to be the very important missing texts, such as Psalm 151, found in both the Septuagint used by the writers of the Brit Hadashah and the Dead Sea Scrolls. Such things as Psalm 151, such things as Acts 29, the so-called missing chapter of Acts. Is it legitimate? We really don't know, but one thing's for sure, it has a lot of interesting insights. We've also included that with a footnote, calling it apocryphal, but nonetheless a good study resource. So we have that, the missing chapter of Acts, 
with the caveat, of course, that it is apocrypha. We fully restore the true names of uh, the Father, Yahweh, and His Son, Yahshua, in the Tetragrammaton and in the Hebrew for Yeshua. There are no generic terms or titles for Yahweh. His name, as it appears in the actual manuscripts, has been fully restored. In the Brick of the Shah, for example, we use the Aramaic word Maria or Master Yah, Lord Yah, Maria, for the full justification of reintroducing the Tetragrammaton Yahweh into the Brit Chadashah text. We have in the book of Galatians, this alone is worth the cost of the restoration of scriptures. In the book of Galatians we have over 200 footnotes, not only explaining that the Galatians were the exiles of Ephraim or the Galut Yah, the exiles of Yah. More than that, we show how it is the most, repeat, the most pro rather than anti-Torah book. The notes will help you to explain terms such as under the law, works of the law, the, the, the supposed negative remarks of Rav Shaul regarding circumcision. All these things are clearly explained within a Hebraic, eternal, non-dispensationalist point of view. You simply have to get your restoration of scripture. We'll talk about a few more things that you'll receive in your own copy of the restoration of scriptures true name edition. We'll have a glossary that right now I believe is over 20 pages with all the Hebraic terms you need to know to keep pace with both the text and the commentary. Additionally, it's a wonderful way to learn Hebrew. When you read a text and you find a Hebrew word and you don't know the Hebrew word, you go into the glossary and it will explain to you the meaning in English of the Hebrew word. I found it even for myself who speak fairly well and fairly good Hebrew that it's a way to learn and gradually pick up Hebrew terms and language. It's a, getting your copies of the Restoration of Scriptures will help you pick up or start picking up the Hebrew language. It's simply there is no tool like it. And we say Baruch Hashem Yahweh for that. Not only that, in the Restoration Scriptures, we have included the weekly Torah portion, the weekly Brich Hadashah portion, and the weekly Haftorah portion. So that, if you're a congregational or home group leader and you want to uh, follow the weekly portions, or even teach the weekly portions, you don't have to scramble or find... Uh, search on a calendar or on, go on the internet. In the scriptures, inside the restoration scriptures, you will have broken down your weekly Parsha, Torah, Haf Torah, and your Brit Chadashah. And what's nice is we've taken the time to match the Brit Chadashah portion exactly to match the Torah portion so there's a continuity that makes sense rather than it being two or three different topics pasted together. So you'll get that as well. We've italicized all the words of the Father, Yahweh, and His Son, Yahshua. This, brothers and sisters, is the most precious tool today. You can literally hand the Restoration Scriptures to a friend and not say a word, have them study the word of Yahweh in their own time, in their own and at their own pace, and basically come to the two house conclusion and introduce the two names to them all on their own, all by themselves, in their own time, at their own pace. There's simply no tool like it. Just the footnotes on Galatians, just the Torah portions, just any of these things individually would probably cost $30, $35 if formatted in some kind of a booklet. But all that is included along with your glossary in the Restoration Scriptures. The Restoration Scriptures is more, is more than just another translation. It is the extension of your Yisraelite lifestyle. I'll say that again. It's more than another translation. It is the extension of your Yisraelite lifestyle. You'll be able to hand the Restoration Scriptures to a loved one, a mother or father, who's not quite getting it. They're not quite grasping what you're sharing with them. 
This will preserve the word of Yahweh in, a for, in an English format that they are familiar with, yet it, through the running commentary, it will open the eyes to show them that Yahweh's heart. Now again, we want to tell you it's not a word-for-word -word translation. We don't, we've never intended it to be word-for-word. -word. Rather, it is a dynamic and prevalent thought-for-thought -thought translation. Every sentence has been so translated to capture Yahweh's thoughts and heart eternally toward Israel. Again, the Restoration Scriptures, true name edition, with the names of Yahweh and Yahshua, is not just another translation. It's going to be an extension of your lifetime, a purchase to last you a lifetime. A true purchase that will last even for generations to come. We give Yahweh all the kavod and, of course, all the honor. Baruch Hashem Yahweh. I've had it asked of me, is this the King James Bible with a few Hebrew terms thrown in? The answer is no. It does not resemble any known translation. There is no modern translation that resembles the restoration of scriptures. It is unique. It is paraphrased, worded, and translated in a unique manner to capture the exciting times we're living in. If you'd like to order your copy, you can call our office today. We'll take your order. Our telephone number here at our office is 1-305-868-8787. Make sure you ask for the Restoration Scriptures True Name Edition. Again, the number is 1-305-868-8787. We'll have that number on the screen for you as well. You can pay by credit card, leave your credit card information, we'll process the order immediately without any delay. Or you can pay by personal check or money order, which will delay your order for about 10 business days. Checks and money orders can be made out to Your Arms to Israel. Again, that's Your Arms to Israel. And drop in the mail to 73 78 West Atlantic Boulevard, Suite 112, Margate, Florida, 33063. Again, your check or money order can be mailed to Your Arms to Israel, 7378 West Atlantic Boulevard, Suite 112, Margate, Florida, 33063. And we'll have that up on the screen for you as well. Uh, again, the, the single price copy is only $50 plus shipping. We'll ship it the best way we can. Tuck in an extra eight or $10, if you would please, for shipping. And if we can ship a UPS, in most cases, it's just a couple of days to get it right to your door. So again, the Restoration Scriptures single price copy, genuine, genuine bonded leather, is $50. For a case of uh, 20, will drop the cost down to $45 a piece. Again, for a case of 20, $45 a piece. If you order 10 copies, and you'll need them, trust me, all right? You will need these copies for evangelism, sharing the kingdom message, uh, parents, brothers, sisters who won't listen to you, but they will read the word of Yahweh, and they certainly have enough reverence for the word of Yahweh not to toss it in the garbage, as they would a pamphlet or a tract or some article you were to give them. For everyone ordering 10 copies and mentioning this special on video, mentioning that you saw this special, for every 10 copies we'll send you one free. So you'll get 11 copies for the cost of 10. But you must mention this special offer and this video call. Say that you saw the uh, spot on the video, on the Your Arms to Israel video for the extra copy. Mention that when calling in at 305-868-8787 and we'll tuck in that extra copy for you free and postage paid. If you want to order online in a secure credit card order form, you can do that as well by going to our website at www.yourarmstoisrael.org. Again, www.yourarmstoisrael.org. And I can tell you right now, that this is the world's only true name, fully two house scripture. There is simply nothing like it. What we thought would start out as a four week project 
is now taking us well over nine to ten months to publish, produce. But it was worth every minute. We have a jewel, and this jewel will be a tool. It'll be, it is Yahweh's word. And Yahweh says, my word will not return unto me void. It will accomplish what I please and prosper where I send it. So it is his word. It will not, it will accomplish exactly what he has designed it to accomplish and bring unity and healing to the two houses of Israel. Reserve your copy now. Remember, your Arms to Israel publishing is self-publishing this edition. We do not know how many publishings we're going to do. There may be one, there may be three, there may be five. You need to reserve and order your copy while the copies last. This is not a sales pitch. This is not a gimmick. This is not a manipulation twisting session. The copies will be hard to find. Simply because when we self-publish, we run into the tens of thousands of dollars. Now most people don't have that kind of financing, and neither do we. So again, get these copies, put them in stock, get them by the 20 or 30. If you're a bookstore or distributor, we want to talk to you. Okay, you call us also, and we we'll see if we can work out a special pricing if you want to be a distributor around the world for the Restoration of Scriptures True Name Edition. Again, our phone number one three zero five eight six eight eight seven eight seven. Reserve your copy of the Restoration Scriptures today. Shalom.